In this video, we'll be going over how to integrate your Microsoft Project Schedule into your Project Schedule tool in Procore. Once it's integrated, any project member will be able to access the current project schedule at any time and from any device. First, it's important to know that there are two different ways to upload your project schedule into Procore. As a best practice, we recommend integrating your schedule through Procore Drive. If you haven't downloaded Procore Drive yet, you can click on the link in the Schedule Integration section of the schedule to download Procore Drive. If you already have Procore Drive on your computer, the first thing you'll want to do is make sure you have the most recent version. If you're due for an update, you will see a red marker on this bell icon. Once you're in Procore Drive, navigate to the Schedule tool. From here, we're going to click the Upload MPP and browse our computer for the schedule file. Once we select it, click Open. Your schedule will automatically be uploaded to Procore and linked to your project schedule tool. Furthermore, when a change needs to be made to the schedule, you can simply open the schedule through Procore Drive, make your changes, and then save. Procore Drive will automatically recognize the new version and publish it to Procore with the change reason without any work on your end. Once the schedule has been integrated with your project via Procore Drive, you can return to the web application and view the project schedule and all of its related tasks directly under the Project Schedule tool. Let's change our view so that we can see all scheduled items in a table format. The second way to upload the project schedule is to manually upload it directly to the Schedule tool in the web application. However, unless you're working on a Macintosh computer and cannot download Procore Drive, Procore recommends that you integrate your Microsoft project schedule with Procore Drive. Unlike integrating the schedule file with Procore Drive, you will have to manually upload the schedule in the web application each time there is a new revision. And doing this will reset all change history associated with the old schedule, making it hard to report on and track changes to the schedule throughout the project. However, if you cannot use Procore Drive, you can navigate to the Schedule tool in your Procore project and click the Configure Schedule Settings link. On the right, click the Schedule Settings page. On this page, you'll be able to set the schedule type and in the Overwrite Schedule page, you'll be able to upload your schedule file. If you want to make sure your team is aware of the upcoming week's schedule, click on the Email Settings page. From here, you can either send them all tasks that are assigned to them or send them a weekly digest of upcoming tasks for the entire project. With an integrated schedule, we recommend sending weekly project schedule emails. In the permissions table, set who will receive the schedule. Whether you're uploading via Procore Drive or not, every version of the schedule gets saved in Procore. You can find each version in the Documents tool under the Schedules folder. In this folder, you can see who made the change and download previous versions of the schedule for reference. Thanks for watching.